Is that yeah. me or Laura? Is that me yeah, or Laura? That's you. Me? <laughs> that's you. I wasn't trolling. I really thought what that she did. There is you. She did it in the news so, yesterday. I thought it was out. So yeah. show me, show me somebody that don't work here. That, that's that's I'll that's incredible news. I that's a very good. That's fair okay, enough. Okay, okay, that's okay. fair enough. That's incredible. Mm. Okay. Let's look it up. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So. All right. Let's look it up. How, yeah, you know, how, how's that? How's that kid? You six months pregnant. Yo, for Lauren, I was really you excited six months, when they six told months, You six months pregnant. Yeah. So now I said that, right? So somebody could give, they could just report well, wait, it. But that's why I ask you. And if it's not true, you just say it's not true. That's it. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Well, when babies are sensitive, B, like, you know. No, that it, is. That's real talk. That's sensitive yeah, talk. Yeah. It may not be time for the announcement. Okay. Yeah, you know, I don't see, any, I don't see anything coming up on the me? Google. Nothing oh, incredible. No. Next, next. We'll be we, well said. We, well we said. Well, then he time. cleared it up. Good job, well. That's it. I mean, um, okay, let's talk about something clear. more fun. Let's talk about something more fun. Um, so not clear. I heard a story. You see Double XL. Let me double XL is reported from Funkmaster Flex that Rama. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, double XL. Double XL. Acor double XL says according to Bossup. Double XL, by the way, y'all can't say according to Bossup. You're more credible than Bossup. You can't then say according to Bossup. Are they? Double XL? I mean, they're at least seen as a respectable musically. journalistic but they're, they're trying magazine. to, you know, clickbait. You know how it goes. Like, that's what Wale's talking about. Yeah, maybe about. it is just clickbait. <sighs> it might just be clickbait for the day. Because you know these... Yo, your poker face got to be better, bro. <laughs> you sitting across from me, my dude. <laughs> The, the the clickbait, they got to put these things up every day and get clicks. Put Boston. up music. Put up music. Yeah. yeah but, build relationships. You know, build rapport. Because, you, you know, now build these people are obsessed with artists. with artists. And they're build obsessed with, with everything that you do. Yeah, build rapport cool. with an artist. Build rapport. And get music. Um, and because that's what they used to do. They have these that rapport with artists. You get these these dudes in the ninety was smoking Philly blunts all day, drinking Alize, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> whatever doing whatever they was doing, and they were still getting them to do what they had to do. Come do the shoot or come to y'all hood without getting beat up or robbed or whatever. Like, you know what I'm saying? So I mean, not I'm not I'm not singling out double XL in any regard, but it's like do do like journalistic work. But like, things clickbait goes up every day. Every day somebody throws up something loose according I mean, whether, to the rumor whether, has it to get whether, a whether it be true or not, it's just like, you know, people have the way... This ain't music we talking about, so... We people have a way of doing things, like you know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Like I'm, 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 I, I kept, it, I kept it so 100 on matrimony that, like, let's say that I'm, I'm in that place again. Why would I want to talk about it right. until like we, I'm at a specific place in that my was life. A great song. Thank you. Yeah, it was a beautiful song. Beautiful Thanks. song. Thanks. But y'all won't get me off what I'm doing. I'm saying that. No, keep going. But I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't want like, you to stop. I don't want. Why would I can't? I'm not trying to rehash certain things. It, you know what I'm saying? So. That's something sensitive, like you know. That's well, if something. I don't, if that's I don't something... see you, if I don't see you before the announcement, congratulations. What do you mean? And you I'm just said I announced it. I'm just saying if it was, if it was the case, why would I want to bring it up? No, I agree with you, and it's very sensitive. It's a sensitive topic. When I had my child, we waited. You know what I mean to make that announcement. You want to make sure everything right. is, you know what I mean, safe. So sound. I'm going to the doctor with everybody. Wale well, like Meek Mill. Um, he's uh, about to uh, hopefully be off. I think he's off house arrest soon enough and, and Dream Chasers and he's on a remix with Fab that just came, I think it just came out mm -hmm. yesterday. Today. Right? Today. Yeah. Or last night. Um, yeah. yes, have you been able to hear any music and y'all yeah, yeah. communicate? Yeah, we got, we got some stuff with, with Ross coming up soon. Yeah. And is that, is he on, is he going to be on Shine, your album? Is I mean, I ain't done recording it, so I don't know. Got it. I, I mean, I but got, I got, I got hundreds of songs done, and then I got songs with him done, so. Let's see. And um and Ross, Ross's case is almost uh, is wrapping up too. I know they're trying to finalize that so he could get back to work as well. Yeah. Has that, how has that been for you? He's still working. No, he's still working. But I know there's been some hindrances in his ability to we traveling now. Slow slow things down. You want to introduce yourself to the people who don't know? Sam Snake. Yeah. There you go. Maybach Music. Yeah. And R DJ. Well, I don't know how it go. Overall, right. overall good guy. Yeah. With just, gray weed. Yeah, and yeah. you in the cut facts, chilling. Facts, yeah. facts. The weed is the weed is always efficient. It's always good. It's you always guys good. smell fantastic. <laughs> always. Said, right. So uh so on the on the uh Dream Chasers project or Maybach Music Project Wale, there there's another compilation. I heard Ross talk about that. Self made four. Self made four. And that's gonna include I think at Wale is interview over? No, nah, no, nah, I was letting Sam get off. He's the A oh. he's the A and R self made. Oh, you putting it all oh, together. Oh, you're putting it together. Yeah, and uh, he's he's the executive producer. So Rose, uh, Rose got us working on it, so it's like is there a date for it? This summer. Single coming. Single coming. Shortly. How frustrating has it been for you, Sam, um, with the inability for me to work as much as y'all would like? 
Ross's issues. Like, seems like I slowed Maybach down over the last, I'll probably say 18 months. Things have slowed. Because there was a period, it was, I mean, there was Maybach music, a Dream Chasers music, a Wale music. Nonstop, yeah. Every, felt like every three months. Yeah, well, it's not really stressful because in the, in the moments, the amount of work that's being done and recorded is tons of music. Right, so it's, it's there. It's, it's right. Yo, like, this not even the, the, my PYT record, not even the first record me and Wale collaborated on. We did the Face Down, Me, mm -hmm. Meek, and him on there. We did, uh, and I did, uh, my first album that I on is Meek's album when I did the um, Freak Show, me and him and 2 Chains on there. Mm -hmm. So, like, we got so, like, so many other records, like, recorded. So, so that's the work's like, happening. Yeah, the just work's happening. The release just, part and the touring part and the promo part is the and part. And all, that, all, all that's going to work itself out. God is great, you know. Everything's all worked out good. Everything happens for a reason. Well, also, it also feels like at some point you have to, ch even if that stuff hadn't happened, Ross, I don't imagine, would have continued the pace he was at. Like, it just, I don't think you would sustain. I mean, maybe some people do. Shit, Prince and David Bowie did for their whole career, right? Like, well, I think that's what Sam is saying. In nah, some you ways, you got to know, like, he, you, you, you see him. He never does. When we come up here, We've just we just coming from the club or some of the studio. We not just coming from like eight hours of rest. If that don't eight hours of rest. You wake up, you feel like we, how we feel. We be feeling like man. Yeah, I been I was a kid in the streets when I met Ross. I was a kid. I was a kid. I wasn't even supposed to be out in the streets. I wasn't even old enough to get in the club. Right. And I met him. I mean, he came to my crib. This before hustling. I met him in the club. He was yeah. by himself. Hey, boy, I want to be the biggest DJ. <laughs> yeah, hey, little nigga, whatever. No, I'm serious. All right, get my number. I'm going to come out at you. Two days, him and Gunplay pull up to my mama house. And on this day, nobody, for some reason, everybody was in front of my old girl crib all the time. But for some reason, that day, nobody was there. It was mm. just, and I was just on the way out, and he pulling up. He in the E-class Benz. I think it was S-class. One of the two. He pulled up, him and Gunplay. What's up, boy? What's up? Come on, show me that shit you was talking about. Going there. Psh. He see all the shoes I got. He like, what you doing? I told you. Hustling these beats. I was really, yeah, beat. Okay, how old, <laughs> how old were you? Like 17? Mostly beats. Nah, younger Mostly than that. Mostly beats. Wow. Mostly beats. Tight. Yeah. And then I was telling people, yo, Ross going to be, shh, Ross, shh, telling you. And he, he had, that's when he had got on that, um, they, later on he got on that trainer record, told y'all. I was like, told y'all, look. Ross, I'm telling y'all. And he's coming with stuff. And then they had been writing for people for a while, too. He's yeah, great. Let me tell you, if, you, if people really listen to Ross old stuff, man, you won't even understand it, man. Like, his storytelling is is better than a lot of people. Yeah, you know? he's Rusty. special. The things he do now is, like, dumbed down to me. Even as, like, special to people, I'd be like, man, that's cool. Do you ever, you push, I know, him? You I push know him sometimes, though? Oh, yeah, all the time. It's like, boy, I know Rosé now. Shh, like, shh. Be like, how, hey. how often do you tell Ross to go back in and cut it again? That ain't good enough. Go back, cut it again as a producer. Um, With Rosé, I don't have to. Because let's listen to the records that he's been featured on with some of the great rappers of today. And he's never been out, out, out rap. Yeah, no, he, he he's doesn't. never been out rap. But he's you, held, but you knowing, but what you saying, you know the old Ross. Yeah. You know what he's capable yeah, of. Yeah, I know. Trust me, you I know. You feel like what he's doing right now, he's just hitting little layups. Yeah, like, it's he's like, not it's really... cool. It's easy for him. Right. Yo, the, but that's the what man I'm saying. So you're not it's challenging easy. him. You're not going, yo, go back in there. You don't have to. All right. Yo, like, you know how... He, you tell yo, Wale to go back in there? You don't have to. You know, but people take their time. Like, they don't just go in there and be like, da 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 and sit down and listen to it for 30 minutes or three days. I'm going into this right. Yeah, like, they don't, like, dog not going to sit there and be like, yo, uh, all right, now, nah, hold on. Come back for another 30 minutes. Nah. Once it's written down, like that boy Meek say, if you ain't write it, don't record it. When he write it, once it's there, he record it. I thought when Meek said that was a shot at Drake. If you ain't write it, don't record it. I think that was well, just that period. If you, I just, just talk period, about time hip hop. I've been talking about I've been talking about ghostwriters like for my whole career. I've For been facts. I've been uh, I've been talking about like you know I, I, it's something I said on something I did. I said um, don't compare me to nobody who don't who who purchases lyrics. And I wasn't talking about no like I went to I'm just talking about in general. Well, because like, it's been happening forever. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Wale, how's uh, how's your besides the person you have this this master? See, this is why I didn't want to give him Hennessy because I knew this was gonna happen. What I'm drunk. When Sorry. Wale gets off when he gets off alcohol. Right, he starts to give a fuck. 
less level Drug. rises. Right? What? You think I don't give a fuck now? You you've you've completely abandoned the conversation. Not that that that, that Hennessy. I'm just vibing. I'm sweating. I got this hoodie on right now. Yeah, I just you, you seem like you're a lot. No, I, I mean, Sam was going on and on and on and on and on. <laughs> but, uh, nah. He dropped some hits in there. <laughs> nah, but I'm just here. I'm in my vibe. I want some more Hennessy, and it's and I'm hot, but I'm good. Where's the Hennessy for the man? Over there. You just there said you don't like when he's off the Hennessy, and now you're passing it We're already Hennessey. there, man. We're already there. We're already there. So what, what would you have well, for I, I, I was just going to say, how are you doing... You know, you've talked about this openly with us before. So, how are you doing with regard to the social media and shit? I, I, I just I speak my mind on it. You know what I'm saying? I, I, there's like three people with my password that just delete stuff after I post it. Like, like, oh, you shouldn't say that. And that's cool. I think it's good. I think it's good. Though. People you mm-hmm. trust, obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For F three is people I trust. And have you stopped reading your? Do you still? Because we see you on your phone, like even right, a few minutes ago. Do you avoid your at replies more? Cause that's really yeah, what. Get- yeah, I mean, like somebody said, like uh, insinuated, I was in the Illuminati this morning. I just think I had to say something because it was ridiculous. But I mean, um, every once in a while, I might swoop in and say something. It's probably deleted now, though. But you tried to stay out of the at reply. Yeah, yeah. Because you, you know mean, that was the realest, the realest words ever told to me while I. That's super vain, though. To what? Me, like only what I say matters. No, it's well. That's how I look at it. I get it, and that's kind of you to think that, but it's not vain when. When you have a, a lot of people that are constantly going at you. I feel you. And nah, people I mean, don't deserve right. access just, to you, have access to you. You're right. So yeah. I, I, you shouldn't feel bad about avoiding your at replies. Yeah. But the realest words ever told to me by the great homeboy Sam, man, who has a new album out with uh, uh, ASAP Rock, um, ha- he said to me, uh, I was like, man, the hate is real. I was dealing with something. He goes, the hate's not real. Just turn off your computer. And I was like, damn, you're right. Literally. They never, they never come up to you in real life. Exactly. Not. Literally, well, the, hate's the, hate's not real. the, the real. love is real. The love is real. The hate's people not come real. up to you in real life and show you love. The people on Twitter that talk all that bullshit never mm. approach you. No, they're you, eggs. They're you, eggs. You're right. So I, I, so I just want you to know it's not vain. You have every right to avoid your fucking at replies. I, I support that. Because I worry about you sometimes because I know you're a real dude I who feels. I knew that's where was going. What? Well, I mean, it'd be, it'd be other stuff going on. You're worrying on about Wale. I do I mean, worry about Wale. Worry about he's a guy who cares. He feels a lot. He's a really good person who's been misunderstood before. <sighs> you and sound like Match.com. Uh, <laughs> Shut up. <advertising. laughs> Anyways, so me, no, but me and Ebro have discussed this because we do care. And we'll be like, man, I hope he's doing well because sometimes it, I know shit gets to you. You're an amazing artist. That's where the great, your gift is your curse. The fact that you're able to feel the gift is your curse. So sometimes I worry about what you're going through at certain points. And there you have it. You going to cry? Yeah, when I get in the car. <laughs> you fall into that too though. Stop playing. Which one? Feeling He's getting super emotional on. He just, oh, no, he just flips it. He just I get on you it. all the time. I, I get mad at him. I'm like, yeah, what are you, you doing? Tell, Why? You can uh, tell. Why? I get mad at him. Go ahead, Sam. Say, so grab the mic, man. I think y'all think he'd be like, like all like in the cut, like, like nah. Yo, he, no, I don't. Not, 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 not y'all. I'm talking about like people. Like, yo, he be so chill. Like yo, look, like you, you read the comment. Yo, look at, and laugh like, like yo, this is like. It's not even serious. Like, is this real? Like, this can't be real. Like, my thing is this on, like a real my thing person? on social media, though, so is like if I'm going to be on Twitter, and I know Twitter is the place for trolling and people getting at it. Like, if I'm going to go in there and I know people want to get at it today, I'm good with Like, it's a competition to me. Like, that's how I see it. You want to talk some shit? Me too. Let's get it on. Bang, bang, bang. Let's, let's talk shit. It's barbershop. It's on the block to me. Like, we just going to talk shit. It don't mean anything. It's Twitter. Nah, nah, I get that. I just don't do it. I just don't even care what anybody at me. Hey, yo. I just do it for Yeah, won't fuck with you. Fuck that. But, Lori, you're saying you don't always believe Ebro, too. No. Sometimes it does bother me. You can tell. Ebro be mad, but he just flip it like he don't care. Yes. Man, I be yeah, he's club. one of those. Yeah, I be in my, when I be in Miami, I, I slide through Miami, I be in the clubs chilling solo or one deep. For real. Like, I don't... Wait. Wait. <laughs> wait. Wait. Go ahead. Wait till a little bit. Nah. I, this ain't gonna it, be like that no more. All right. Why you say that? Let me help you understand something too. I'm real, I'm real, I'm like, I'm known in Miami. So even if I show up to the club solo, it'll be three, four people out nah, line, maybe 15 people I know, maybe three. So you already got people in the club. They there. But I'm 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 normally in the cut chilling solo. I'm getting lit, drinking a bottle time. of water. You're a positive guy. Yeah, and it's all and everyone know that. But uh, I don't want to go ahead. Wait, what happened? He wanted, to, he wanted to tell you how it really was. No, 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 no. He didn't want to get too much. He didn't want to indict. He didn't want to get nobody indicted. 